Hi everyone, it's Angela Dahlgren, and today I'm giving you a tour of a deluxe studio and one bedroom model at Disney's Riviera Resort. This is Disney's 15th Disney Vacation Club property, and it's set to open December of 2019. Adjacent to Disney's Caribbean Beach Resort, the theme is influenced by both Europe and the Mediterranean. If you're wondering why it's called Riviera, in the lobby, according to Disney, you'll see a unique art collection celebrating beloved Disney characters and icons influenced by master artists who found inspiration along the European Riviera. Disney's Riviera Resort will have access to the Skyliner gondola system, which will take guests to and from Epcot and Disney's Hollywood Studios. And it will actually have its own Skyliner station with easy access to Disney's Caribbean Beach, Disney's Pop Century, and Disney's Art of Animation. Looking at the hallway, let's walk into a deluxe studio. Like a lot of DVC rooms, there's two separate places to get ready. There's a main sink area, there's a place with a toilet and shower, sometimes a sink, and then there's a place with a bathtub and sink area. But in here, you just have the shower and toilet. I don't know about you, but I really like this marble look. It just looks really classy, really expensive. I mean, I don't know, walking in here, I would just feel like, okay, I'm in a nice place. It's a classy place, you know what I mean? And if you notice a little shakiness in the video quality, my phone stabilizer died the day I got to Walt Disney World. So I'm completely freehanding this with, with the filming. So I apologize for that. Or if you see like a finger in the bottom right hand corner, that is why I apologize. So let's talk a little more about Disney's Riviera Resort. There are going to be approximately 300 guest rooms, and those will consist of studios, one, two bedroom villas, and grand villas. And there's also going to be a new category called tower studios, and those will sleep two guests each. So that will be very small. Oh, there's me. Hi. See, look, I'm filming by myself with no stabilizer. That's very difficult to do. You kind of have to like brace yourself and post and it's just, it's hard. I don't recommend it. Walking further into the room, you have the kitchenette and that kitchenette has a mini fridge. It has a coffee maker and a microwave. I have to say, I love the backsplash, that blue. It's just calling to me. Amazing, beautiful. And then you walk a little further and you have a Murphy bed. This room, this deluxe studio sleeps five. So obviously that sleeps one. Look at that little sleeping Pascal, it's so cute. What I really like about this room and the next room that we will see is that there is built-in storage underneath the bed. So you can just slide your luggage underneath and then, you know, it's out of the way. But my favorite, favorite part about the room that I did not get to film is that big picture right above the couch. You see those railings on either side. You pull those down and it becomes a bed. It becomes a queen size bed and the couch just goes right underneath. And it's way more comfortable, I'm told, than just kind of those sleeper sofas that they have been having in the DVC rooms. So that is going to be a huge thing, I think, in the future. Very excited for that. Okay, that is the studio bathroom, and looking straight ahead is the one bedroom model. Let's head into the bathroom first. To the left is going to be your washer and dryer, and to the right is going to be a sink. Groundbreaking, I know. I'm sorry I'm not opening the closets and everything. I had very, very limited time in here, so I wanted to just give you a quick tour and you know, get a video out so you can kind of see what to expect should you choose to stay here. Bathrooms are very similar as far as design. I'm really liking these grays and I'm not really a gray person, but you are not here to listen to my opinion. So please leave your own below in the comments. I would love to read them. We have the bedroom here. It comes with a nice desk, a very majestic headboard. My, look at that.
more room underneath the bed for storage. It's a very elegant look overall, wouldn't you say? Very clean with the artwork, not too much there. Going into the main living space is where it gets a little busier with the print, a little more artwork. You have another Murphy bed here. And straight ahead you have another one of those pull down beds that I described in the deluxe studio. Look at that cute Mickey, oh my gosh. I love what they are doing with these Murphy beds. The newer ones where they have a design once you pull it down, it just gets me every time. That is a door leading to the balcony and there is the fake balcony image. And you have a full kitchen here. You have everything. You have the dishwasher, you have the stove, oven, full-size fridge, everything you need to really live here for however long you're staying. And that's all I have for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, please leave them below and I will answer them if I can. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.